Hi, I'm Dave Cross, Photoshop educator and instructor for Creative Live. This is how to export an OBJ file from Photoshop CS6 Extended. Now it's important to note you have to have the extended version of Photoshop for this to work because OBJ is a 3D format and it's only available if you have the ability in Photoshop to make and export 3D files. Here's how you do it. Now, I already have a 3D file here, but I'll just show you real quickly. All I did was I took a type layer, and under the 3D menu, I just choose 3D extrusion from selected layer. And just by doing that, now I can rotate this around, and I have a simple 3D bit of type. Now, the catch is, to be able to export it, I have to render it. And that takes a few minutes. So I'm going to go to a file I've already rendered, and this is the result. If I click on it, you can see it still has all the 3D information. But when I click on the background layer, this is what it looks like. So to be able to export this, I have to click on the layer. Now I can go to the 3D menu and choose Export 3D Layer. Down at the bottom of the Save As dialog box, it says Wavefront slash OBJ. I choose that. I name the file. Now in the second window, it's going to ask me what type of format I want for my texture. Generally, with an OBJ file, we use Photoshop. Click OK, and then we're done. Now I would still save this document as a PSD file to preserve the 3D editing capabilities. Now remember, before you can export that file, we need to render that 3D file, then we can go to the 3D menu and export that OBJ file.